All right, welcome back for another unboxing video. Uh, this is a special little treat. I did a little, what I would call dumpster diving, going around in the uh, right stuff clearance bin, and uh, happened to come across this. This is the limited edition complete box set of Doki Doki School Hours, released by Genian Entertainment. A uh, little something about this. Um, this is originally uh, Sensei no Ojikan was uh, originally serialized in Bamboo Comics from 1997, and a 13-episode TV anime series adaptation was created and aired on TV Tokyo from April 4th, 2004, to June 27th, 2004. And there was also a seven-episode OVA, Sensei no Ojikan Gold. Um, also produced by the same company. The episodes were released onto DVDs of the TV series, one for each DVD, and both the TV series and OVA series were dubbed in English by the Ocean Group and licensed for release in North America by Guinean Entertainment. However, with the North American release, the OVA was folded into the TV series and rebranded Doki Doki School Hours, and of that meant for this release that episodes 14 through 20 were the OVAs. So 1 through 13 would be the TV series, 14 through 20 are the OVAs. Um, the plot, basically a very short 27-year-old teacher has an interesting time trying to teach her class. She has to deal with the eccentricities of her students as they present themselves over the school year. And when you have an insane class, including a cross-dressing narcissist, an otaku, a dumb jock, a boy band obsessed girl, a lesbian in love with the teacher, a homosexual in love with the jock, a guy who looks like a middle-aged man, a girl obsessed with material items, and a vain rich girl, what's a person to do but hope? <laughs> so that's kind of the quick overview of the series uh, from Wikipedia. And let's go ahead and cut into the box and see what we get. And once again, this is a limited edition complete box set that was released by Guinean Entertainment here with episodes 1 to 13, plus the OVAs. And... Kind of been having some fun lately going back and... Uh, I call it upgrade, some of you might call it downgrade, and going back and trying to uh, get the original um, releases over the newer re-releases, because I like collecting the boxes, obviously, and uh, let's see, before I go any further, why don't we first start with a look at the box. Nice, sturdy chipboard art box from Guinean, as I've probably said a few times already. And look at the top. And here we have our discs. Comment card. I wonder if Guinean would comment back. <laughs> Just kidding. Right. And, yep. Insert. And cover. And perhaps I should turn on the light for this. There we go. Yeah, it's getting to be late in the day, so I don't have a lot of inside light to work with here either. So, do you want to uh, see what's inside, or do you want to see the reflection of the light? <laughs> damned if you do, damned if you don't. Again, basically, the cover is also on the insert on the other side. 
Oh, let's see. I don't even remember if I showed the back side of this one yet. Sorry about that. I seem to be getting ahead of myself here. Okay, this is disc. Let's go to disc three. Hate it when I get to doing these out of order. Third hour. Of course, Funimation should take some notes on screenings. This is what a disc screening I think should really look like. Nice and colorful and not one tone and cheap. I think I got ahead of myself again and forgot to show the, uh... oh, there we go. So when I start this way, this time with the fourth disc. Available July 2006. Oh boy, that's such a long time off. <laughs> sarcasm, sarcasm. All sarcasm completely intended. Now available, one through five as a box set. Now that we've sold them all individually, we want you to buy them again as a box set. Thinking of that, there's actually a video that will be coming up in the next couple of days that uh, I've actually managed to pick something up that was <laughs> kind of funny that it was the art box and then a uh, limited edition CD plus a pack-in, but no... Uh, no volume of the anime because it was completely intended to be for the people that had bought all three. So they sold an art box and special edition separate from any episodes of the anime. Don't really, I can't honestly say I remember seeing that happen before, but, uh, and while I'm at it, I decided to also upgrade my, uh, or downgrade, as some of you will probably say, my uh, complete collection of Kujibiki Unbalance over to the art box set from Right Stuff. And they had a, uh, again, I found this in the clearance bin. And, uh, well, actually, it wasn't the clearance bin. It was like the, uh, the combined, like, deals thing they have going now where they take the... Uh, collection and put it all together and sell it for a discounted price. So I was able to get the uh, art box for Kujibiki Unbalanced plus the three discs for $15. So uh, probably be putting my complete collection onto eBay or taking it off to half price books to uh, sell off and reinvest into uh, something else for the collection. So. Once again, keep tuned. There's uh, plenty of pickups that'll be coming again in the next week or so. Uh, ordered a few things off of Amazon to uh, downgrade. <laughs> or actually, for some of them, I just needed to pick up an art box. And so I decided to do a rebuy on the first edition just to get the art box for everything. So uh, once again, thanks for tuning in and we'll see you again later.